Cancer, Sun, Moon, and Rising for the month of January 2022. These are your messages. One more. Shuffle and start. All right. You have the Ace of Cups, so new beginnings, blessings from the universe and the divine. You have the Temperance reverse, so they could have been imbalanced in the past. You have Queen of Pentacles, feeling secure, stable in your um, material resources and otherwise. You have the Five of Swords, which is crowning you. And you have the King of Pentacles as your foundation. So there's, um, and your overall energy is four of wands reversed. Behind that, you have the hangman, right? So there could have been instability in your home, in your family, um, in your uh, basic uh, structures. But you're looking at things from a different perspective, and you're going to spin this wheel to get out of this stagnancy uh, with regard to your home and family. Or they could have been delayed in some celebrations, weddings, engagements. Maybe also dealing with a Capricorn Taurus Virgo who is who is unstable, who is being arrogant, who is you know not being generous as well, and who could be you know extremely boisterous and um, stubborn. So in the past, this could have caused you imbalance. You could also may have been dealing with the Sagittarius. You the the, the you. You felt, uh, you know, an imbalance and things not working in your favor. You felt, uh, you know, uh, impatient as well. You wanted things to work out fine, right? You could also have had conflicts with this person, you know, where you feel, okay, either you or them, they feel that they've, you know, won every argument and feeling very uh, victorious. But this is going to be you know, short-lived as well. Um, but your current situation is Ace of Cups. So there could be new beginnings with the Cancer Scorpio Pisces or there could be new emotional be uh, beginnings. There could be an offer of some sort um, in any area of your life which will emotionally initiate, uh, you know, satis emotional satisfaction, something new. Uh, and it is divinely uh, given to you. So you're going to feel strong, stable, resourceful, abundant in the future so that's an extremely good thing now we'll just clarify um, the temperance reversed why did you feel this imbalance in the past so here you have the knight of pentacles reversed so as i said you know you, you may have either not got you know some job offer or there could be a capricorn taurus or virgo uh, who is not giving you or providing you certain funds or you could have been waiting for some investments and that may not have you know, happened. Uh, it's taking really slow to come along. Um, let's see this King of Pentacles reversed. Okay. The Empress. The Empress and I have the Hermit. Right? So you could have also been dealing with a Virgo or Taurus, yeah, Capricorn, Taurus or Virgo. Um, you may have been, you know, supportive in, in helping out this person, but they seem to only give you imbalance. And then that would have made you, you know, get into this introverted position and not, you know, uh, and looked at the matter. And that is why you felt this imbalance. Um, let's see the Five of Swords. Five of Swords is Five of Cups River. So you, there could have been some emotional hang-ups and issues with regard to this person in your situation, but obviously getting over it. Uh, there are two fives, so there could be a lot of change, changes, but it's all transitionary. Uh, and you see the two cups here. You may have really, you know, lost hope, but then here you have the Ace of Cups, so there's new beginnings emotionally. Um, Queen of Pentacles, or you may be feeling very... Uh, you may have got gotten over the, you know, emotional upsets of the past. Ah, six of Cups. So you could be reconnecting with a Taurus, Capricorn or Virgo from your past. Or you may be reminiscing about the past. Uh, you may be meeting family. And that is making you feel abundant, joyous and uh, 
complete right so this is your reading i hope you enjoyed it please like and subscribe to my channel